match two that they faced a lot of dot deliveries slightly uppish but goes past the according to uh, third good run slightly short pulled away nicely done a lot of power and timing into that that's a nice ball oh that's gone right through that's uppish will just clear that infield it's been played straight, so a little safe. Maniba gets a couple. And uh, that's gone. That's the first wicket gone. 12, uh, 12 the, the score and uh, the pressure that was uh, created by the South Africans. Yeah, the pressure of dot balls getting to Maniba. She had to go after the balling. Is there an edge? Is there an edge? Yes, there is. Another one gone. Two in row for the clerk. This time, Sadashams. Down the leg side, was trying to play it uh, for a four on the fine length boundary. Just got to uh, play it to the keeper and the bowler, the clerk, so happy. She's bowled well. You batter, batter. Sadashams gone for a duck. Nicely driven. Nicely driven. This will be the first boundary. Boulder, another one to Clerk. That is beautiful bowling, consistent bowling by the Clerk. Excellent fuller ball, Yorker length. Sidra Amin had no answer to that. Clean ball and played that shot over the fielder's head, the 30 yards uh, fielder's head. And then you release pressure because you get a few boundaries and the field also changes. As the, as the score suggests, just 24 runs. This one was sweetly timed. Could not quite find the gap. Bisma, this is what she does. Bowler again, another one. Going to class this time. This was an in-swinger. Played for out-swinger. And this is what happened. This is our mainstay. Bisma, gone. Trying to play across the line, paying the price. Oh, it was in the air for a little while. Almost cotton bowled. Nearly gone. Full toss, dealt with some power towards Square Lake. He's down after winning the toss. They've lost four batters. That's a good cut shot by Alia. Finding the gap will be a boundary to start off with. Ah! Oh, that should be out. That should be very close. Very, very close. And since they are batting up the order at four and five or five or six, and they've lost the top four, they don't have a choice. That's a good shot, good connection. It'll be a boundary. But can they sustain this? And that should be out. That's a good catch. From what we saw in the first game, in the first row, yeah, the keeper was struggling. Jafta this time. Exceptional catch by Jafta. Again, as you said, she was struggling with the keeping side, but now she, in this game she has showed... Spawn the gap on that occasion. Good looking shot for a boundary from uh, Sidra Nawaz. Yeah, yes. I was just going to say that. Was just going to get to that. Lot of Wolfar at short cover because Sidra likes to play that drive and she can hardly control it. A lot of bottom hand in it. Well, you're absolutely right. She likes that drive. And again, it was as I was talking about it earlier. And a good shot going towards the cover region. Some runs here for Alia. Good stop. And come back for two. Swinging Yorker. Nicely played. She went deep in the crease. Allowed her arms to free and found the gap. In the air, just over the top of that mid off fielder. She was lurking back on the edge of the circle. Through the gap. Chase is on, but in vain. Goes big and goes over. Couple of bounces into the fence. Alia Riaz. 
Alia was advancing down the pitch. Umpire. And then understanding what the... Oh, that's a good shot. It's a nice looking shot on the onside. It's about timing. Maybe runs here. If she beats the fielder, yes. Boundary to Fatma Sana. Good shot on the onside. You can fancy the chances of getting more runs because only two fielders on the onside. Clearly getting turned. Once again, uh, nicely played by Fatma through the onside. That uh, of dot balls straight down the ground. Good. Oh, oh, that's sloppy. The fielder was in, on, and that's Fatma Sana bringing up her 50. Her first 50. Look at that smile on her face. That is really heartening to see. She's really fought hard. She's been attacking. And she's been looking to score runs at any given opportunity. Well-deserved half-century. Well played, Fatma Sana. Before sweeping the ball. Oh, edge. Pakistan will take any runs. But once again, more evidence of turn and a long chase for Kaka. Fatma Sana will come back for the third runs. Down the wicket, another edge. Tucker is giving the chase, but in vain. That is a meaty blow. Couple of bounces, Fatma Sana. Full toss, umpire has already called it a no ball and it's running away as well, another boundary. And Ali is pushing for two, looking to get to her 50. There you go, 750 for Alia Riaz. What a magnificent knock this has been for her. Joyous and jubilant she is. Although the job is not done, but she's really played fantastically well. Was with me, they were losing wickets. This again, the first delivery she stumped. They're still waiting for third umpire, but in my opinion, it looks out. Tossed up delivery. Atma came uh, down the wicket, couldn't recover, and gone. I think so. It might be undone. She might be undone. And she is undone and uh, out. Yeah, nothing taking away from the effort that Fatma Sana has played here. A superb inning. That is close. That is close. Yes, given. That was a straightforward decision for Empire. Yeah, that's brilliant bowling. Umehani stuck on the back foot and uh, that is where she got stuck just above the pad but right in front of the wicket so given out straight away. That's what dipped in in the air. Simple decision. Simple catch. Easily taken. She was looking to go over that field. The same field that we were talking about. All she could do was just give a simple catch to the field up. Another wicket down. Innings trying to play this over the covers uh, head, but only succeeded to play to the captain Walwart who took an easy catch. Alia gone for uh, 53 of uh, 86 deliveries, good strike rate in the given circumstances. I didn't even take the mic, but we lost another wicket. It's uh, nine wickets down now. Another wicket gone. And just look at this. Uh, nicely pitched up delivery, playing across the line. And uh, gone. Bold class, who's bowled really well uh, to these tail enders. Good consistent bowling by the paces. Sadiq Iqbal beaten by pace of class. And the very first ball she's, she faced.